I'm going to show you how to start a fire with a paper clip and a battery pack. So first thing we're going to want to do since we're starting a fire is have a way to extinguish that fire. So I've got some water right here. I can toss anything in. Obviously normal fire precautions are advised. I've also got safety glasses on and since we're vaporizing a piece of the paper clip we're going to want to make sure that uh, our eyes are protected. If we're doing this in a survival situation, we'll have to just turn our head. So first thing I'm going to want to do is just bend out one piece of the paper clip. Something like that. This is going to be our shunt. This is the portion the electricity will go through. This other part's just hanging out and we can use that for multiple attempts if we don't manage to get it on our first try. I'm going to clip right here and right here. Before we clip it, we're going to make sure that the battery pack is off. If we clipped it hot, we're going to risk sparking and burning ourselves. So we make sure it's off, and then we're going to confirm it's off by tapping the leads together. And since there's no sparks, we know it's off. So you'll have to inspect your clips depending on uh, how your clips are arranged. The side might be easier to clip. In my case, the front is easier to clip. And I'm going to leave about an inch of room and make sure they're nice and clamped down and you can pull on it a little bit and it's nice, it's nice and clamped down. Then we're going to take our kindling, in my case some newspaper, and we're just going to wrap it around the element. And we don't want it so tight that it smothers it, you're only going to have heat for just a second. So something, something like that. All right, now we're just gonna turn on the power pack and it'll light up. And there you have it.